Sam Lloyd, a comm student from Northern California, is the creator of iTalk, a program here at BYUI that helps students share their ideas to the world. The idea for iTalk came to Sam from an unlikely source while here at BYU-Idaho. Pretty random. Uh, I was sitting in my B100 class, this is before I switched to comm, and we were talking about um, just taking, I think it was we were talking about like taking chances and just really trying to utilize resources while you got them. And so I was thinking about the school and everything and, and, and all the things that we have here. And I decided that I really liked public speaking and I really liked TED Talks and everything that TED does. And so I was like, oh, well, why don't we bring like a student version of that to BYU-Idaho? Although iTalk is now a successful practicum, it did not come without a challenge. What happened was is the school, as I was trying to pitch this idea for it to become a society, the school gave me a lot of pushback. Um, when I say the school, I mean the administration. Brother Embry, the advisor for iTalk, has seen the practice from the beginning to where it is today. As, far as iTalk itself, I was asked to be the advisor back when it was a society, and we very quickly realized that it didn't belong as a society. It belonged as a practicum in the communication department. That allowed us to do a lot more. It allowed us to engage more students and uh, provide students with more opportunities than we would have had as a society with a lot less administration oversight and a lot more, we could make it more of an academic uh, an academic program. Sam's role in the creation of iTalk has been crucial to the success of many students participating over the last two years. None of this would happen without Sam. Um, there's so many things in iTalk. We were talking the other day, um, me and some of the coordinators, about how iTalk could be broken down to a million little things and it'd be easy to get distracted. But Sam definitely keeps us all on course with our purpose, um, that we're the bridge to effectively tell our story to the world and it's, he just keeps us clear on understanding what it is that we're doing and helps us reach those goals and he pushes us to do things that we never thought to do. And one of the things about Sam that I think is amazing is that uh, he is someone that has a clear vision. He knows what he wants iTalk to be. He's willing to put forth a tremendous amount of time and energy to make it that. And I think he's, he's not motivated by any personal interest. This is just really his opportunity to do something wonderful for other students. And he believes that this is a powerful tool to help students, students learn to communicate. Although Sam has done a lot, he credits the people around him for the success of iTalk. The end goal and the ambition is probably centered in me. Um, but accomplishing that ambition, accomplishing that goal came from the support of many people. And so I guess the proudest thing that I have about iTalk is my gratitude. My gratitude to every person that has contributed. Um, because of them, we are where we are. For Scroll TV News, I'm Lauren Miller.